Experiment 5, Parts 1 and 2, Testing of Vesper Prediction with Quantum Theory. We will use thioformate ion, CHOS minus, as an example in these videos. To draw the Lewis formula, note that this ion contains 18 valence electrons, 17 from the neutral atoms, plus 1 from the negative charge. Assuming carbon is the central atom, the other atoms are attached with single bonds, which requires 6 electrons. The remaining 12 can be added to oxygen and sulfur to complete their octets, but carbon still has only 6 valence electrons. One way to solve this is to use one pair from oxygen and share it with carbon, which forms a carbon-oxygen double bond. Lastly, we add the negative ion symbol outside brackets, or the symbol could be placed next to sulfur, which has a minus 1 formal charge. Now around carbon, the Lewis formula shows three bonds, single, double, or triple, and zero lone pairs. Vesper predicts a trigonal planar molecular geometry. Now we'll test this prediction using the PM7 method. The PM7 method in the MOPAC 2016 program. PM7 is a semi-empirical quantum method that is extremely fast and accurate for molecular geometries. To do these calculations, visit the website set up for this class. To find it, just Google UAF WebMO MOPAC. Click the graphic and log in as guest password WebMO or use another username specified by your TA. Add an atom by hitting the key for that letter or by using the periodic table tool. Add bonds as they appear in the Lewis formula. Any geometry is okay. Set the formal charge on sulfur by right-clicking that atom and entering minus 1. Now do cleanup comprehensive ideal. WebMO guesses molecular geometry based on a set of Vesper rules, which may or may not be correct. In this case, it guessed trigonal planar, and it put in the ideal trigonal planar bond angle of 120 degrees. However, just to illustrate better how the geometry optimization works, I will distort the geometry. MOPAC is the name of the software that has a PM7 as one component. Just use the first available server among several that are online. Enter a job name that includes your name. Choose Geometry Optimization. PM7 is the default method, but MOPAC has several different codes built in. The charge is minus one and the multiplicity is singlet because there are no unpaired electrons. Click continue to submit the job. When the job is complete, click the job name to see the results page. So, it did optimize to trigonal planar, but the bond angles differ from the ideal. The heat of formation is minus 70.48. The geometry sequence indicates that it required 10 steps to achieve the most stable geometry. The graph indicates that distorting the planar geometry destabilized the structure by a whopping 100 kcals per mole. So, success! Thioformate ion is indeed trigonal planar when optimized with the PM7 semi-empirical quantum theory and is originally predicted with Vesper.